Hey guys, today is on having a strategy. Having a strategy, but before we strategize, please allow my brief prelude, which I have now conveniently recorded for our mutual comfort and especially luxury, and it goes like this. Hello there, my name is Robert Francis. It you is. stumbled on my Unconquering Schizophrenia YouTube channel. That's right. Where me and the bird. That's right. That's right, that's right. We talk schizophrenia. We do. This is the cut of my jib right here for reasons of my medical confidentiality. I'm a licensed clinical social worker times 15 years. That's true. That's a lot of gabbing and chatting. Unfortunately, I've been yes. diagnosed with schizophrenia for a score five and one. Yep. And that puts a little gray fleck in my beard. Surely does. Thank you for joining me on my channel. Now to topic, to topic, to topic. Having a strategy going into uh, social situations... Um, and uh, let's say, do you have a strategy? Like, in other words, if you are okay and you get significantly triggered, like big time triggered in a social context, do you have a strategy? What are you going to do? I call it my go-to cope. My go-to cope. It's the thing that I go to first all the time after I get triggered. And for me, that's con learning to control or not learning, but controlling my behavior despite my cognitive turmoil. That's my strategy. So if I get significantly triggered, I know I'm going to control my behavior. So I have a strategy going in. So uh, it's good to have a strategy, and it's good to know what your go-to cope is, your go-to cope. When you get significantly triggered, you should have something in mind, like this is what I'm going to think, and this is what I'm going to do if I get significantly triggered so that you can work yourself through the trigger and uh, continue to participate in the social environment. So I was just curious if, uh, if you have a go-to cope like I do. All right, guys, that's it for today. It's hot, hot, hot. We're in the middle of a, uh, a heat wave, and uh, I'm going to melt into a small puddle now. Thanks for joining me. We'll see you next time.